Here we have the Black Box Lunchbox DMR repeater. Let's open the box. Here is the main unit. Included in that box is a user guide, and also included will be the power cable wall charger. Let's put those aside for a second and inspect the main unit. All right. Going through these parts one by one. Here is the main battery pack. You can see it right there, battery pack. You turn the actual battery on, on this power button. You can see the light comes on. Now to turn the actual repeater on, we go to the repeater button right down here. Uh, first thing to do on that, uh, set the time and date comes up. You can change that if you want to with the up and down buttons. Uh, but just go ahead and confirm that for now. Press the confirm button right here. Now it's all basically ready to go out of the box. If you have one of our Go DMR radios, it is also set with the Klein Electronics defaults, factory defaults. So out of the box, this repeater will repeat on channel one with the Go radio. Just hit transmit. It might be hard to see on this video. In the upper left hand corner you can see the signal strength and you can see once the radio is transmitting to the repeater and it's repeating. I'm going to go ahead and transmit on this Go DMR radio right now and you'll see the indicator um, in that top left hand corner change. You see those bars coming through? That means it's coming through the repeater and repeating out. Right when that radio starts transmitting, you can see on the unit the transmit as well from the indicator. Okay, let's go through the rest of the unit. Here we go, starting. Here is the battery charging port. Let's see. LED indicator. Like I said, that was the power button. P1, P2, P3, P4 are all programmable via the software. The software is a free download via our website, uh, kleinelectronics.com. I will show you a quick screenshot of what that software looks like in the programmable button section. Here, this knob is the volume knob. This port is for the programming cable. The programming cable is USB on one side. Here we go. And that part just goes straight in there screws in and this part goes to the PC to program the repeater to any channels you like. The charging cable simply plugs in right here. The red light will come on. Once this is all plugged in both red lights will come on once this is plugged into the wall. This cable. Once it's fully charged the green light will come on. The last, the last piece of equipment is this. The last piece of equipment is the antenna. The six, uh, it's a ten-foot cable with a six-inch mag mount antenna that will screw right into the front of the unit. You can see it right here. That just screws right in there, and you're all set to go. Turn the unit off. You just hold down the power button. And that's turned off and now you turn off the power from the battery pack and you're all set the other the other unit available battery you can see it right here there's no battery pack and the plug just goes straight in there to the wall